Andrea, absolutely divine this time of year and so needed, aren't they? I know, aren't they beautiful? Oh. I know, I definitely need them in the mornings with Ab all these frosts and things. Absolutely, oh. we do. Now, you've got three gorgeous colours. We have, and the thing is, it's for, they're at a fantastic price. $31, I think. We'll better oh check that. Oh, my gosh. Is that right? They yes, are too. Just $31. Toss so them in merino, yes, these are, so folks beautiful beautiful softness as well and then if people are um, after we've got the fingerless ones as well which people love yeah. the fingerless ones because you can still put your hands in your pockets and get your coins out and use your uh, keys and all those absolutely. sorts of things absolutely and scratch your face without actually getting all the, and, all the wool over it as well and more importantly <laughs> use your iphone your smartphone <laughs> <Yes, I'm laughs> which is clearly the key to everything but one interesting fact as well even if you've got the gloves like well, the full fingered ones that you have there okay. you can actually get some a special wee thread that you sew into the finger that you can use your smartphone with. Oh, you're joking. No, I need to try and track some down. Maybe I need to start selling I, that. I think that's a really good <laughs> idea. Hats. Now, goodness me, I had mine on this morning. Beautiful. Look at these, even for the children. $33. Absolutely stunning, aren't they? And you feel that softness. Oh, and, and they've gosh, got the, yes. They, they stay on these. really well. And we've got those lovely bigger cable knit ones. Oh, yeah. And I still love the pom-pom hats. They still look so I divine, know. don't, don't they? I know. Don't know. They've been really, really popular. I bet they have. As well. Now you do the lovely sets here as well, Andrea. Yes, yeah, so there um, we've got a lovely loop scarf, which is a re really, really versatile scarf, and then the wee hats as well. And then we can't forget the poncho, which I'm my, my usual yes, uniform. Yes, of course. Um, so they come in all those same colours, and we've even got heavier. Um, oh, heavyweight gorgeous. poncho here as well, which zips out to be a full knee rug size. So oh, really versatile, fabulous. great for travel and things like that. So, so we've it got can those. double up as a rug or a poncho. Or, or a poncho, I yes. Love it. Now, what a beautiful selection of alpaca you've got here. Very classic colours, all the neutrals. They are beautiful. Aren't so they again, all this alpaca here is all undyed. So oh, it's just you've got beautiful, your beautiful, beautiful cream, you've got your greys, your, your browns, and then you've got your deep, deep charcoals and blacks and things as well. Well, Absolutely And beautiful. we've got some more of our checks down on the couch here, which are stunning. Aren't they beautiful? So this one here is just snuggly. You just really want to be snuggled up on that one. And then if we look over to the shelf here, we've got all our gorgeous colours. mohair range. So we've beautiful. got almost 40 colours. So you can see them all there, heaps and heaps of options. And then we've also got a few checks here as well which are lovely. But one of our most exciting things about the store is obviously our seconds and samples in the end of lines area. And how, what about this one? Gorgeous, Isn't absolutely stunning. The Mohair store down here, Beckenham Central, 140. Beckenham's, uh, Beck, uh, blah, 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 Columbo Street. Yes, I'm all corner, corner it's too of, frosty. I know, <laughs> corner of Col Columbo and <laughs> Tennyson Columbo. Street. We'll get it right, Columbo <laughs> and Tennyson at Beckenham Central, high five. <laughs> we did it. The Mohair Store, 140 Colombo Street in Beckenham, Beckenham Central, which is on the corner of Tennyson Street and Colombo. Grant from Eastern Dry Cleaners joins us. Welcome, Grant. Thank you, Jean. Grant, it's winter time, and of course the kilts are back out for the schoolgirls. Yeah, yes, and we're coming up to school holidays in a few weeks' time, so now's the time to be organising to get the school uniforms cleaned and, and repaired if repairs are necessary. Super. And, uh, a lot of folks do leave it to the school holidays before they do clean them. So sometimes the child wears the kilt or the school blazer for a whole term before it gets cleaned. And when it comes in for cleaning, it can be pretty bad. I can but imagine. Uh, 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 sometimes we have to dry clean them two or three times and treat stains and things be, uh, before we can actually get them to a state where they're ready to press and look smart. Goodness. But one one thing to avoid is washing them at home. Oh yes. yes. Okay. Now, what this... kind of pitfalls can they come into there? It just ruins a very. They're expensive well, items. Well, they are they? expensive yeah. items, and. Uh, 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 so a lady, lady turns up at our front door, she said I decided to, comes into the shop, she says I decided to wash the kilt and try and save the money on getting it dry clean, but I can't press this, uh, no. can you press it for me? And we say well yes we'd be delighted to press it for you, but uh, there's so much work involved in this we're going to charge you nearly as much as if we'd actually dry, dry cleaned, cleaned it and pressed it for you. Because yeah. when, when you dry clean it, the, uh, the, the pleats don't drop out. Right. Uh, so okay. what's so it's much easier to press. But you can see this is all wrinkled and oh, twisted and everything. And uh, 
And, um, You're basically uh, putting the pleats back into it again, yes, aren't you? Yes, you are. Uh, yes, you are. And you can imagine that our presser thinks, oh, this is going to take a long time. Oh, I bet. <laughs> I can but well anyway, imagine. Here's, here's one that has um, uh, is, is been beautifully cleaned and pressed. And uh, uh, you can see it's got the uh, oh, box gorgeous. pleats on it. And mm. you'll see that each pleat carefully follows the line of the... Uh, of the tartan, uh, uh, of the tartan. Mm. and this is one that our presses oh, that. aren't that fussed on uh, but you can see it's been beautifully pressed except that I've oh, gone and squashed it gosh. but let all me these... hold that up because that will actually <clears throat> that... oh sorry Oopsie. Grant I'm just about choking all, all these little pencil pleats oh. they can take a lot of doing absolutely good god I wouldn't want that job <laughs> oh but that's incredible yeah. Bring your school uniforms to us and we'll have your little darling looking uh, really, really smart to start the school term. Absolutely, they're expensive items so make sure you look after them properly. Eastern Dry Cleaners Limited, it's a free pick up and delivery of your drapes or clothing as well. Uh, uh, clothing from the workplace. Okay, at uh, yeah, your home or your workplace, they operate citywide, 379 4, Huge welcome to John from Dusheen Dental. Hi, Hi, John. How are things? Very good. Now, you've been jet setting around with your work. Oh, I have, I have. What's all this about? Well, I'll tell you in a minute. So, okay. uh, remember, we've just done a, a brief history of uh, some of the significant changes in, in the denture world. We did indeed. And implants was, a, was one, injection moulding, BPS was another one, and Dr. Abe from Japan. Um, and I've just been over with Japan from a colleague from uh, Melbourne and Sydney as well. Thank and uh, there's Dr. Abe just coming up now on the right, um, and uh, me in the centre, and part of his team. Uh, just, to the just to the left of me is a, is a patient that I treated over there. Oh, fabulous. And he's come up with a concept uh, of suction, uh, increasing the suction of, um, that's his uh, book there. Oh, and wow. it is a significant, way we now think about uh, approaching uh, lower denture design and getting uh, suction. And we've, there's lots of things that we've noticed over the years as clinicians and really probably failed to comprehend the significance of those. Yes. And he spent his life uh, coming up with this uh, concept and techniques. And okay, now you, you mentioned the lower. Is mm -hmm. this something that isn't used on the upper? Or? Well, no, yes, the upper denture, it's about suction. Okay. and uh, our ear gets in under dentures and, and you lose that suction. Yes. Uh, an upper denture, we generally don't have a lot of problem with suction as a general Is rule. Is that right? And with gravity, you'd think it would be that way around, well, wouldn't yeah, you? Yeah, and the lower denture, uh, yeah. our, our conventional thinking, uh, if the voucher is increasing uh, the support here, and also sometimes the design lets air get under the denture, so it loses suction. Right. So, um, yeah, it, it challenged my thinking. And uh, so part of my thing now as I spent the days and read the book is to introduce that into our practice. You're very, and teach it. very good at mm. keeping up with all the latest oh. and greatest technology. It's something yeah. you're really passionate about, isn't Absolutely. it? Yeah. So you take this back then to your professionals that work for you? Yes, and yes. Uh, so we're actually off to Melbourne. Uh, Dr Abe's coming out to uh, oh, no, Sydney. He's doing a, a, a lecture uh, in Sydney and Melbourne uh, next month. Great. So uh, I'm taking a team, uh, one of our, we're part of our team over oh. to listen to him and we will be uh, introducing it into our practice because it, it is such a significant change and looking forward to it and, and teaching it to others. Goodness me. Yeah. And ha tell me, how's the Colombo Street? Oh, Colombo is going? going very, very well. Fantastic. Very, well. very good indeed. Look, for any of your dental needs or just inquiries, you have a fantastic DVD as well that people we can come and pick up or you'll post yeah. out, won't you? Yeah. Make sure you contact Dusheen Dental at 236 Springfield Road in Merivale, phone 375 4444 or website dusheen.co.nz. A very important part of TOP's property division is property management. And here are the experts, Joe and Sharon. Nice to see you again. You too, Jay. Now, we've been looking at um, themes, and we have been looking at, uh, we'll be looking at themes over the next four weeks. The first one we looked at was inspections and maintenance the collection of rents, the rent reviews, and of course the establishing a rent figure, and most, most importantly, selecting a tenant. Is that correct? It is, yeah. Right, now today we're gonna to have a look at the collection of rents. Of course it's vital, 
How do you go about it? What are your systems? Um, our system is that when a tenant signs up for a property, we expect them to set up an automatic payment so that their rent gets paid every week. Um, obviously the day before they moved in, so they're always going to be a week in advance. Right. Do they have to pay a bond? Yes, they do. Uh, we ask for a three-week bond. So with a three-week bond, um, is that held by you or is that by a special bond? No, it's bond? held by the Department of Building and Housing. Right. Mm -hmm. So you manage this entire portfolio? Yes, we do. Okay. Payouts, Sharon, how, how are they um, handled? That's up to the owner. They get the option of getting a um, fortnightly payout or a monthly payout. Uh, I find that a lot of our owners probably prefer the fortnightly payout. It helps them to manage their money better. But, um, they have the option of both. Great. Now, of course, with payments of rentals, you've also got expenses. Now, do you handle that? Yes, we do. Right. Now, how do you go about that? Uh, the tenant will ring us and tell us that there's maintenance that needs to be done. Mm -hmm. um, we'll then assess whether or not it's actually the tenant's responsibility or the owner's. Uh, we then notify the owner and ask for approval. Right, so do you then mm -hmm. sort of go along and inspect the property and say, well, this and this and this has to be carried yes, out? Yes, we do. Right, once that's done, um, do you arrange all the financing? Uh, the, the, what happens is the rent sits in our trust account from the tenant uh, mm -hmm. and that money is used for maintenance before the owners get the the rent. Right. Mm -hmm. So actually you're responsible for the property and as a landowner or as a landlord you don't have to worry. Mm -hmm. Okay. What have you learned in this business so far? <laughs> what have you learned, Joe? <laughs> We've learned plenty. <laughs> um, There's a lot of good people out there. Oh, absolutely. There are. There really are. Some women have met some lovely tenants, tenants and owners. Um, yeah. Sharon, do you think it pays to have a property manager looking after your property? Oh, absolutely. I mean, the majority of our um, tenants are lovely, but every now and then you're going to get a little bad egg, and it's that's the sort of pressure our owner doesn't want to have, have to carry, you know. So we all deal with those problems for them. Okay, if I own a property and I ring tops and I say, right, I've got this property, how soon do you do you respond? Immediately. By immediately, what do you mean? That day? If, oh, that within within. Half an hour. Right. Yep. Okay. You've, uh, we, I mean, if we're not in the office, we get a message sent directly to our cell phone um, and then we respond. Right. So, yep. say we have a meeting at six o'clock that night, mm -hmm. what happens? What's the procedure? What happens? What, what do you do, Joe? You, you, you come round to me at yes. my property. Yep. Right. And now um, we bring an information uh, booklet, we bring some information about your property because we would have mm -hmm. done some research. Um, and, yeah, so, just, you, you can actually research a property we before can. you go to it? Okay. Yes, we can. So, what do yeah. you look for? Uh, we can't oh. tell you that information. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but um, we do. We have a, a, you know, a good knowledge of the property before we go to the property. Mm -hmm. yeah. And you can tell whether I'm a good egg or a bad egg. <laughs> 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 so, okay, you would come round and then what do you set up? How do you, how do you set the procedure up? What do you do once you've, once you've seen me? What, what would you do, Sharon? Oh, we'll go back to the office. So we'll do some research on um, current rentals in the area mm -hmm. and um, give the owner a price which we think that they would be able to get if they were to tenant their property. Okay, so you, that's negotiable obviously. Absolutely. Right. Okay, and then once that's happened, then do you inspect the property? For sure. We um, will take a, um, a detailed inspection of the property, i.e. we will take photos of the interior of the property, the mm -hmm. external property, um, gutterings, grounds, I mean, and so that we've got a fair copy of what the property looked like at the beginning of a tenancy to ensure that the property remains in the same condition at the end. Now saying I'm a very lazy landlord and I say to you, okay, I'm not very interested in cutting grasses, doing the hedges, doing the maintenance, mm -hmm. have you got a team that'll take care of that? We do. Mm -hmm. so I mean generally grass, like mowing the lawns is a tenant's responsibility, mm -hmm. lawns and gardens. Um, hedges uh, can become the owner's responsibility. Right. Mm -hmm. Do you find that most tenants will mow lawns? Yes. Yeah. Do you have to leave a lawn mower for them? Not unless it's a furnished property. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. So there's a difference between an unfurnished and a furnished rental? Yes, there is. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So is that part of your discussion with the landlord? It is. Normally the landlord knows before they contact us whether or not they want to rent it out furnished or unfurnished. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then. I know this is next week's theme, but this is absolutely unfortunate that you have to discuss this. Rent reviews. How often are they carried out? Uh, we carry out rent reviews um, generally at the end of each, um, you know, when the tenant's lease is due to expire and we're going to renew the lease for that tenant, we then do a rent review for them.
Mm-hmm. So the rent review is what, yearly, six monthly? Uh, it can be six monthly. It can, you, you're not allowed to put the rent up more than once in every six month period. Right, so. right. So obviously that would have to correspond with things like maintenance, but not only that, also rates mm-hmm. and also insurances yes, as well. exactly. Okay, so there we have it. That's uh, the second theme that we're looking at with Tops and probably lovely to see you again. We'll catch up Thank with you, you next week. Thanks, and um, we'll look at rent reviews, we'll look at themes, also establishing the rent figures and um, how we can contact you of course uh, is um, at Top Realtors Limited Shop B and you find them at 135 Farrington Avenue in Bishopdale 359 5595. And here we are back again at Phil's Furniture Warehouse. How are you, Phil? Good, Andrew. Yes, Good. Sir. I'm not too bad. Yeah. Now, we're standing here among all your amazing beds. Mm. And that's the thing, you've got an, a huge store down here. So, if we walk down and see what sort of lovely beds you've got. Well, we do have the full range, and it goes right through the different um, styles of bed. Lovely. And the thing is, as well, what I love about here is your prices. Uh, brilliant. Well, so we, we look like at that, twelve ninety nine. Uh, beautiful bed, eight ninety nine. It certainly is. We keep the prices right down. Yeah, and you can see the comfort in that bed. This mm. looks amazing. Full and again, range. we've got yeah, have got the full range. Yeah, queens, king singles, singles. As you know, so if we, if we walk over here, we can see some of the singles and the king singles you've got. Mm. Which again, these are really a really popular bed for well, yeah, for, for everyone really, and for you know, spare room for the young and old. Absolutely. Um, and wow, five forty nine. What are they? Are they six ninety nine? Full range of them. Wonderful. And of course, people can then buy the headboards if if need be. To so you've suit. got the lovely yes, your, yeah. your, your white or your classic wood. Very Wonderful. Good. Now the other thing as well, you've got all your lovely furniture as well, which is Full lovely. Range of drawers yeah, and yeah. Oh, heaps different sizes. Beautiful mirrors. Yeah. Velvet cherry, white, black. You've just got it all. I've got it all. And we haven't even gone and seen all the, your lovely couches yet. We haven't. But we will head over to Together. these great chairs. I mean, so, oh, what's this? A four ninety nine. dollars Complete combo set. Very Gee. popular. I bet, at mm. that price. We have trouble keeping up with stock on those, but Gosh. we've got good so stocks come on at the in. moment. Mm. Now, these oh, the jade chair. wonderful chairs. So we mm-hmm. demonstrated these these the other week. So come on down. You've got to have you've got to sit in one of these beautiful chairs. Only eight ninety nine. But the wonderful thing as well, if you are interested, come give them a call and they'll do a free home demonstration. Yeah, we're happy to do that for our customers. That's great. Now again, these these chairs, you can hop in them, re- recline, and then jump right back up, and they do everything for you. Do everything for you. Phil's Furniture Warehouse at Bishopdale Mall opposite the Westpac Bank. They're 100% local since 1973. And here we are back down at my men's store at Bishopdale Village. Now, as always, there are so many shirts and amazing deals to be had down here. So first up, if we look at some of these beautiful shirts, look at this. Ben Sherman, absolutely stunning shirt. Then we've got lovely Brooksfield range. This one here, Best Mountain, only $27. So it's unbeatable prices. And then we've got lots of well-known brands. You've got your Rod and Gun, you've got your RM Williams. And then if you look along the back wall and down, there are just so many more. Heaps of pattern. There's, there's your stripes, your checks, all different colors. Just a whole heap to choose from. You do really need to come down, come on down and have a try and pick out your favourite colour. Now, moleskins. Barry down here with um, my men's store, he has got the best selection of moleskins. So he's the Bishopdale Village is really the moleskin capital. Now, heaps of different colours, there's even seconds of moleskins as well. And then we've got the lovely Tussock Creek range of, of trousers as well. Look at those prices, $99, absolutely unbeatable. Now, if you come on down here, it really is the, the brands you want at prices you want. It really is a clearance. You've got end of lines, your samples and everything, and so many wonderful, wonderful brands. Now, there's a great deal we've got here. Now, this is the wonderful Logan brand, which is obviously well known. Now, beautiful polar fleece, only $41, so unbeatable deal on that. Now, 
we go over here and we've got knitwear. Now, there is such a huge range. It would probably take us a whole show to, to, to list it all. So a lot of it is beautiful and New Zealand made. You've got your fisherman knit jerseys, a whole heap of colours. We've got these, these cardigans, these half zips, these full zips. There is just so much. Now, this looks like a huge pile, but we've just been told that there is going to be a whole heap more delivered in the next week or so. So definitely come on in and find your knitwear. So we can see what else have we got down here. So some more cardigans here and the beautiful zips. A whole heap of range of colours as well. And if we look just over to the side here, we've got the lovely range of all the vanilla shirts. And you can't forget the beautiful merino jerseys. And if you're after hankies and socks and scarves and things, you've got to come down and get your stocked up on the wonderful world of hankies. So it's brands you want at price you want. So come on down to my men's store. My Men's Store, brands you want at prices you want. Shop 11, Bishopdale Village Mall, Monday to Saturdays, they're open. Now, here we are today down at the wonderful Cat's Pyjamas. Hey, Glenda, how are you? Hi, Andrea. We're really well, thank you. It's so, I haven't been down to a store for a wee while, and it's oh. so lovely to be in here. It's just beautiful. Oh, thank you so much. And now, yeah, on these chilly days, Cat's Pyjamas, isn't this a fabulous oh. scarf with all the cats on it? And believe it or not, it's 100% wool. So just wow. absolutely fabulous. So it feels so light and fine. That's incredible. And just really neat. And the other 100% wool yes. one we've got in at the moment is in the orange colourway. So now, it's really, really pretty. Those colours are stunning. Very fashionable colours they for this winter as well. They certainly oh, are. Wow, so and fit yeah. that's a beautiful song. And you get that beautiful warmth as well. So you yes. get your lovely fashion statement and the warmth, which is really, really good, isn't it? It is absolutely fantastic. So lots of scarves in at the moment. Some lovely pais paisley oh, shades, the wow. greens. There's some navy ones coming through as oh, well. Oh, I'm a bit of a navy fan yes. at the moment I'm as well. And we've person. got this beautiful one here. Yes. All your lovely bright colours. Look at that orange so at the just, bottom and the yellow through it. Yeah. So just pop Dang. on in and have a look. So many scarves to choose from. I love the yellow one. I oh. up that yellow one. I, I know. Quite it's like. a stunning colour and it's a little bit, it is acrylic but it does feel That's, like wool. Yep. And they're just as and you warm. still get you do still get that warmth. I've got a couple of lovely acrylic ones, and you just get that really lovely colour and that texture and things that yes. you might not get with other with other fibres as well. It's now, right. where can we look up on your well? It's wall art. so great that you can come into the store and see all our big wall art that we can't take to the studio. No, that would be a little bit tricky. And then your shop would look very, very empty. So it's the thing is, you've got such a range as well. It's so a like huge the, variety. So there's, there's metal wall art, um, and we also have prints. And some of the prints are a 3D effect, such as the wine one up there. So this oh, is, it is too. It's a little bit different, and there's something for everybody, we hope. And looking over to the bird one, that is just stunning, isn't it? Yeah. And then you've got your lovely big canvases paintings here as well, haven't you? The big print canvases, big print. yes. That's 1.5 metres long, and people are looking for that bigger rectangle look. Well, that's the thing, and especially with people that say if they, if they repainted their, their rooms after, you know, EQC and bits and pieces, and they're wanting a really good feature piece, that would just be perfect. Your beautiful that's clock what, and clocks and um, lots of novelty uh, wall art as well with the little signs that, for yeah, grandparents the, yes. and the Irish wisdom, and the dreams. We look here, the, the, the coffee lovers types of coffee. Yes. Very nice. And yes. now that is it the birds and the copper there. Yes, that's a different colourway in the metal art with the birds. But lots Gosh, of different ones to appeal yeah, for all sorts of different sizes. And that's size the lovely spaces. thing here is that you've got such a great range. You got really have something for everyone, don't we you? We have, and you really need to come in and have a look because it changes constantly. Definitely. So come on down and see Glenda the team at the Cat's Pyjamas. The Cat's Pyjamas Giftware Barrington Shopping Centre here in Christchurch, 337 2337. 
You're a bit of a fashion guru, aren't you really? Not really. Hi everyone. Uh, uh, we were talking about stilettos and, and ballet flat shoes. Yes, we were. Mm, having, yes. A, having a good debate about that. We, yeah. won't, we won't tell you the outcome of it. No, not However, yet. there's loads of beautiful merino. Merino, yep. Yeah. So I brought Rambo, the sheep, in just to show you. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Thank Sound you. effects and all. Um, Lots and lots of colours. We've just got a lot hey, of these. I haven't these. seen this one, Tony. It's I love that. Just beautiful. Uh, that beautiful is sort of like olive. a moss, yeah, olive, olive, yeah, olive moss love green. That. And the lovely um, cerise. What, middle age and up, this colour is just so incredibly kind. That, that colour? Yes. All oh, right. Yes. What about this colour? Would well, that be kind? I think that'd be kind. Stunning. It's not cerise, as long it's as you fuchsia. Can wear cool fuchsia. Mm. Yeah, because it's a blue base. Yeah. Very beautiful. Yes. So these are New Zealand merino. They're not imports. This is the real deal. It's mm. mostly central Otago merino. And wow. uh, 39.95 a metre, 150 wide. And generally, most tops long sleeve are taking about one and a quarter. So for $50, you've got it. Most of the bought ones are I 200. Had, I've already had a lady, lady in the studio today, and she said, look, I've got Harold's fabric in my top and my trousers. I had the dressmaker make them oh, up. fantastic. She looked amazing. The fabrics were just beautiful and then the dressmaking on top of that were just stunning. So oh, I that's thought, great I to hear. That. That's great to hear. Yes. Yeah. Yes, we get a lot of people with getting good results and mm. it's, it's actually nice to see people wearing the garments in too. Absolutely, I yeah. bet. So this is a wool as well. This is a wool that's coating. gorgeous. And it's reversible, so you've that. got you know either side. And it's on the special, it was $49.95 down to $39.95. Oh, and that would be good for all age groups too. Oh, you know? absolutely Little, it is. You know, kiddies right through to adults would be brilliant. Yes, mm. gorgeous. I do love it. Yes. Uh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, gee, there he's, yeah. he, gets, he keeps getting in the way, doesn't he? Uh, <laughs> this is, quick this is not Gordon. Merino. <laughs> this is actually um, Pubia cotton. So... Only fourteen ninety five a metre. Now it's one fifty wide. Everything today is one fifty wide. Feels beautiful. It's lovely to do a pillow slip and trim the sheeting in yeah. this. How gorgeous! Yeah. Jammies and some people with their leftovers, they'll use, you know, one of the wee, um, one of the wee oh, critters, a and they'll just applique. applique. Oh, yep. what a super idea! Yeah, so that's only fourteen ninety five. So one fifty wide. Gorgeous. It's huge. Uh, 150 is five feet. So. Yeah, that is very now, wide. And lastly, right here, corduroy. Normally, the corduroy is from 16.95 to 19.95. These two colours, 11.95 a uh, metre. And of course, it's the season where you can't find corduroy in the shops. No, that's right. It you is need it. Unbelievable. To stay yes, warm. I'm not happy. <laughs> Harold's, the trusted name in fabrics. The warehouse is at 47 Birmingham Drive. Open 10 to 4 Monday to Saturday. Tell your friends. Um, I got, why have you only got um, boxer shorts and a pair of running shoes it's on? It's not true. <laughs> Bad influence. Strange man.